bless you, Lord. Thank you, God, for this night. Let's clap our hands for our God, brothers and sisters. You know, I have this crazy dream, brothers and sisters. We don't know what heaven looks like. No one knows what heaven looks like. But for me, I have this crazy dream that someday I will get to heaven. I'm sure you all want that. Amen. <laughs> Is anyone here doesn't like that? <laughs> I'm sure we all want to be in heaven. Amen? Amen. But I have this crazy dream, brothers and sisters. I dream for a time. And when I will be in heaven, I would have a left hand. But you know what? You know what? Even if I get to heaven and I don't have a left hand, that's okay. You know why? Ask me why. Because I know that my left arm and my entire body would be shining in God's glory. Brothers and sisters, remember this. Despite the desert moments of our lives, we're always called to go back home. Despite all the challenges that we experience in our lives, remember that our true identity is that we are sons and daughters of the King. Amen? And we're called to always go back home into the loving presence of our God. If you look at the cross, brothers and sisters, the cross that is in your hand right now, whether it's in a rosary or just a cross, that cross you're holding right now, brothers and sisters, is a reminder. Let that be a reminder that from the cross, Jesus extends His hand to each and every one of us that even when we are broken and wounded, we can always hold on to Him. Amen. Amen. We can always trust that He is with us, whether we are in the desert or in the, in the oasis, we can always trust and believe that He will not forsake us, brothers and sisters, so we can rest in His loving arms. Amen. Because of after all, brothers and sisters, heaven is the destination. That's where we are called to be, to be one with Christ to be in the loving arms of our God. That is the true oasis. There is the true oasis. And that is what where we are meant to be. Brothers and sisters, God's love is found every day. And this love is discreet. It is respectful. It is also free. It's also free and freeing. It is a love that heals and raises us up. We are always raised up. Our God always raises us up every day in whatever circumstance we are in in our lives. Again, when we actively seek Christ, we will find Him. He will allow us to find Him. Amen? Amen. And this is our homecoming. This is our way towards the promised land. If we make straight the way, we're going to get there. But let's not live our life as if heaven is not the destination. Let's live our life as if we are already there. Amen? So in every moment, every season, whether we are in the desert or in the oasis, brothers and sisters, remember that we are truly loved. And by that love, we are sure that we are always home. I 
Strength in the sand against doubt and shame.